Oh boy, wake up New Zealand before it's too late. Remember Khrushchev's prediction? This is a sobering reminder. It's almost 62 years since Russia's Khrushchev delivered this. Many of you may not remember his quote or even were alive when Mr. Khrushchev of the Soviet Union made his remarks. On September 29, 1959, here was his entire quote. Your children's children will live under communism. You Americans are so gullible. No, you won't accept communism outright, but we'll keep feeding you small doses of socialism until you finally wake up and find you already, you already have communism. We will not have to fight you. We will so weaken your economy until you will fall like overripe fruit into our hands. The democracy will cease to exist when you take away from those who are willing to work and give to those who would not. Ian goes on. Remember, socialism leads to communism. So how do you create a socialist state? There are nine levels of control. Read the following recipe. One, health care. Control health care and you control the people. Two, poverty. Increasing the poverty level as high as possible. Poor people are easier to control and will not fight back if you're providing everything for them. Three, debt. Increase the debt to an unsustainable level. That way you're able to increase taxes and this will produce more poverty. Four, gun control. Remove the ability to defend themselves from the government. That way you're able to create a police state. Number five is welfare. Take control of every aspect, food, housing, income, of their lives because that will make them fully dependent on the government. Education. Take control of what people read and listen to and take control of what children learn in school. Religion. Remove the belief in God from the government and schools because the people need to believe in only the government knowing what's best for the people. Class warfare. Divide the people into wealthy and the poor. Eliminate the middle class. This will cause more discontent and will be easier to tax the wealthy with the support of the poor. And number nine, control the media. Not much left for our comrade Jacinda to do. As I read through each point, I realized while I was reading just how far we have followed that road. It really is quite devastating. I leave it with you.